What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another Force of Will unboxing video with Nova. Don't worry, don't worry, Master Fidra. Like I said in the previous video, he's just busy, but he will be bringing you more Force of Will content. Um, I'm just kind of starting to get onto the game. We're just doing this, uh, these unboxings because he was quite busy and he's been working quite a lot. So that's the only reason because I'm starting to get into this, into this game. I just kind of want to do unboxing and kind of go through it and, and, you know, so you guys kind of get to hopefully pick up on my enthusiasm about the game because like I've pointed out in every single video, these, the artwork in these cards are so top notch. Just unbelievable. Oh, all right. Okay, here we go. So, and this one you have two, okay, sorry, let me forgot to do what I wanted to do. So we have two. First one is mechanical. He's the mechanical, he's a machine. So this is the machine side of, of things. And this is the, what kind of doesn't make any sense to me is that this is the water deck. Just give me two seconds and I'll verify that 100% with you guys. So this is, yeah, it is the water deck. New Van Halen entry set, water. Okay. All right, going through it, we have Arthur, King of Machines. Ooh, wait, how is he a machine if, that doesn't make any sense. Okay, so for this one, this is just, I don't understand how he's a machine. This digital one just does not make any sense. So I'm gonna be passing this off to my wife and then the off screen camera, but one side is the ruler itself and the other side you have what the ruler becomes like the upgraded version. So how does King Arthur become, and it's listed as a machine. It just doesn't make any sense to me. Uh, Antimatter cannon Excalibur. Oh, I'm gonna like this deck as well, especially since it's going down like the uh, Arthur path already. Caliber, the Sword of Judgment. Ca oh, Caliburn. Okay, I totally read that wrong. Uh, target two resonators opponents, control your opponent's deck. So I'm gonna the bottom part there oh. and then the bottom part. Oh, okay, all right, all right. So I forgot about the little footnotes. So this, I'm gonna do it here and then hopefully zoom in. So hopefully you guys can see this little footnote right there. Uh, within the castle in the sky lies Arthur and his Knights of Steel. Okay, and the second side is the knight created by Deuce Ex Machina. Continue to carry out the duties in the world. Oh, I'm confused. That doesn't make any sense to me. Oh, okay, all right. I, th I thought it was supposed to make sense, but okay. Uh, charm. Checkmate. Okay, this one's questionable at best. Consume. Consume, that's, that's, a, that's a very questionable graphic. Uh, Gawain, the Swift Knight. That's very cool. Oh, this one's cool too. Um, okay, I'm just trying to put these back in order, but Gretel, the Misty of the Woods. Look at this one. They're vampires in this game. Um, yeah. So the darkness deck, we have there's um a Lich and Lucifer. So I'm gonna that is what they look like. Sorry guys, I'm gonna keep going through this, but Loki Washdog. Fernder. Oh, that's kinda cool. Maintenance, quick ass, put two 1,000 counters on to two machine resonators, machine of the bishop, mechanical bishop, mechanical bishop. All right, okay, so that's this deck. What happened to, did I lose it? Oh, I didn't lose it, it's right up there. Thought I lost it for a second. Okay, that goes in together. And then we're gonna go off to the second half. So the way these these are these sets, and I don't know if I pointed it out, is the way the structure is, it's you have enough to build one full deck, or if you want to start playing and learning the game right away, there's basically like two little half decks. Excuse me for one second. <coughs> okay, so on this side we have Loki, the Witch of the Chaos, and what's her? Oh, Loki, cool. Okay, so she's a witch, but still controls mechanical. Okay, mechanical soldier. Oh, that is cool. That's a one giant gun. Monstrosity. Oh, I like this one. This is sort of like werewolf, like gone manga 
style. It's very weird, but it's cool, so cool. Overflowing knowledge, draw two cards. I like this divinity card. Perseveal the Shining Knight. I don't know if I like this one or not. It's very cool, but in terms of, I don't know if it works for me because it's like a futuristic robot with like Jedi sword. It's kind of weird, but it's cool. Like, oh, petrification. Very cool. Reconnaissance. See, here's the weird part. You have like this image of like King Arthur, the machines and all that, sorry. So let me zoom back out here because I may have done all that and I, so if I zoom back out here. Yeah, so it was, I was getting to, it's like, you have this image of like the old style castles and King Arthur and all of a sudden there's like machines and stuff. So it's kind of like, I don't know what you would call it. Like, it's not really like steampunkish. Would it be steampunkish? I don't know. Scarecrow guide. All right, so we're getting on the yellow brick road now. The witch's house. I like this witch house. If you look really closely, there's like all these hanging things in the background. Then you have like a hanging loop if you want to commit suicide, I guess. So it's kind of cool. Uh, water map. Okay, well, these are the stones. And at the end, once again, we have the floor. So, sorry, kind of got sidetracked with my wife walking in on the video, but this is the last unboxing one. Unfortunately, I will not be doing the darkness ones I mentioned in the previous videos, but again, I will be building the Lich deck, but my favorite card by far and what brought me to this game is definitely, definitely 100% Lucifer card. So, I'll just bring these down just a little bit, but um, tips and tricks, guys. If you want to give me ideas, since this last uh, video until, you know, kind of come up with a deck one next time, Please give me some ideas for what I could do for the Lucifer deck and what I can put in. Like, mind you, I don't have very much to work with until September 28th, until all the darkness, like, booster packs come down and stuff. But I am pretty excited. Not pretty, very excited for, um, for trying out Lucifer as well. But we will see. For now, this has been Nobin. I'll see you guys in the next video. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Bye-bye.